Welcome to the channel. My name's Rob and I love watching Australian comedy. And now, all aboard. Thank God you're here. <laughs> that is an awkward way to get into the stage. Come around to four ships. Coming around, sir. Steady as you goes, Coxon. Steady, sir. Can, um, could you? Is there any chance you could send in another cabin boy? <laughs> Jeremy's getting all passive aggressive on me. Thank God you're here, sir. My God, man! Hey! So if anyone doesn't know, if you're new to the channel uh, and you haven't seen Thank God You're Here, basically a celebrity, a comedian, gets put into a scenario where they don't know what's going on. And you normally get actors um, that are playing the lines and it's down to the, the comedian celebrity to actually improvise everything and, yeah, go along with the scene. Ah, uh, feels good. Should we uh, cap the anchor and uh, come around? Let's come around. <laughs> Stand back. Oh, I, I love giving it a bit of a spin. Let's see if we can do a donut. <laughs> so, uh, what do you want done with the fucking crowd? With the... Fatic shrouds. Oh, the fatic shrouds. Put them on the fatic dead people. <laughs> Where is the fatic shrouds? Oh, God. So he is very shouty. Oh, my first ship was Tom. <laughs> a little wooden ship. I had it as a boy. <laughs> yes, but you mean the first ship that I captained on the high seas. That was not a silly name like Tom. <laughs> that a boy would name his ship. That was Rick. <laughs> but back then, you were just a mere midshipman. Now, you are the rank of none other than... Super Human Driving Shipman! <laughs> Could yes. you remind us again, what is the mission that we are sailing on? Well, we are tracking the flight of Venus, and then we're going to discover the Great Southland in much the same way that the Hamburglar discovers hamburgers. God. My God, man! Is that... Can you see land on the... You know what I think would be an appropriate way to celebrate the fact that we found the Great Southern Land? What, sir? Let's hear it! Aussie, Aussie, Aussie! Oi, oi, oi! Aussie! No! See, you guys in Australia say Aussie, Aussie, Aussie. We say Oggy, Oggy, Oggy. Oi, oi, oi. Isn't that funny? I wonder who came up with it first. I reckon we came up with it first and you just turned it and Aussie-fied it. Uh, but he's quite good. He's very shouty. And I think in this scene, it makes sense to be quite shouty. Uh, you're on a ship, you probably would have to shout. Uh, he... <sighs> I really want some reaction, though. I want some reaction from the actors. He's he's doing his part. He's doing his lines, and he and he's and he's improvising. I want a little bit more from the other two, if I'm honest. I'm not familiar, sir. <laughs> Tell me, what should we bring back for Good King George? Oh, let's bring back one of those platter pie, so that when he looks at it and he sees a duck's bill and a beaver's bum, he goes. <laughs> <laughs> Very good, sir. Ship ho, sir. Ship ho. Ship ho. Let's it. see if we can drag it. <laughs> it appears to be a frigate. Oh, let's chuck one of those fracking shrouds on it. <laughs> Is that what they were called? It seems so long ago. <laughs> My God, but you're lovely. <laughs> Is he actually, like, out of interest, is he actually gay anyway? And he's just playing up to it. I've got to assume that is the case, and it's fine. Uh, and I like the way the little stare down then. But is he actually gay anyway? Maybe he is. I want you out within 15 minutes! Sir. Sir. There is something I, I wish to discuss with you, sir. Uh, it's a small matter... I guess you have heard the rumours about. <laughs> <laughs> I 
You get lovely by the moment. Oh, the moment. Yes, sir, they... The men are saying that there may be a woman aboard, and you know what that means. OK, I'll admit I have brought a young lady aboard. You, but, sir? You know, you brought that sheep. <laughs> <laughs> It's a bloody woman! It's a woman! Oh, that's why, because you can't have ladies on board. It was a woman, really. He's not actually, maybe he's not actually gay, even though he was, you know, eyeing up my old matey boy there. Excuse me, Commodore, is there anything else you want me for tonight? Oh, Jeremy. <laughs> Jeremy, your boys, your boys features. Make me feel proud to be in the King's Navy. You're a fantastic young man, and I'm going to rot you within an inch. <laughs> sir, oh, sir, get to the boat out. line's gone astray, sir. What has? The boat line. The boat line? We're heaving boxes and we're midships. What shall we do? Well. To the midship, sir. OK, to the midship <laughs> and the mizzen hold. Sir! <laughs> Sorry, I know, I know the captain shouldn't desert his ship, but <laughs> I'm getting out of it. <laughs> well, that is how to end a scene in style. Literally run off. <laughs> He's abandoning his ship. He played that quite well. I, I enjoyed that. He was very shouty, which I think makes sense for the scene. Uh, he was definitely playing on sexuality a lot, wasn't he? Um, but no, he was good. I, as, I, I still wish the other two played off him a little bit more. I know they've got to sort of stick to lines because they've got to get the scene done, but I would have just liked them to play off a little bit more. But I, I thoroughly enjoyed that. It was silly. Uh, it was it was it was clearly funny, and I just love these improv shows. I absolutely love them, and they are bringing "Thank God You're Here" back. So there will be new series. Hopefully, I'll be able to watch them. Uh, I've got a Plex server I can hopefully use. I enjoyed that. Uh, yeah, my chore is a little bit, uh, a bit sore now. But thank you so much for watching another Australian video where I've had a little bit of a laugh. So make sure, if you want to see more, I've got so many in the back catalogue. So make sure you like and subscribe. Go check out more. And I will catch you next time.